Hi guys, welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm making lemon asparagus chicken. Alright, I'm starting out on a large skillet and I have some olive oil heating up in there. I'd have to coat the bottom of the pan. I'm going to take three chicken breasts. Sorry, Dexter. Actually, it's two large ones. I'm going to get them down into my oil here. My oil isn't quite the temperature. Pull that out. Turn up a little bit. And when my oil comes up to temperature, I'm going to brown these for about eight minutes on each side until they're cooked through. And I'm going to season them with some salt and pepper. And I'm going to get my salt and pepper on there. I'm going to season them with a little bit of Italian seasoning. And when I turn them over, I'll season the other side. So I'm going to fry these for about eight to ten minutes on each side over medium heat. So they're golden brown and are cooked through. But right now that my chicken's all nice and golden brown and beautiful looking, it's not cooked through. I'm going to have to finish it in the oven because it's just not going to get done in the frying pan. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put that in a 400 degree oven for about 15 minutes to finish it baking through. I drain the olive oil out of the skillet. I'm going to add in about three tablespoons of butter. And my heat's off right now because this thing's smoking hot. But I'm going to get my butter in here. Throw that out. And I'm just going to stir my butter around here real quick and pick up some of that goodness off the bottom of the pan. This is a cast iron nonstick skillet, in case you're wondering. Okay, now to that I'm going to add in... I have one pound of asparagus that I cut into roughly about one and a quarter inch pieces. So I'm going to get that in the, into the butter. And I have one red onion I diced up. We're going to get that in. And that's just going crazy. I think he knows I'm making chicken. And I'm going to season this with a little salt and pepper. Alexa, stop! That's my timer because that's pasta going. I'm going to allow this to saute for about five minutes to soften up that asparagus and those onions. Alright, I allowed that to saute for five minutes over medium heat. Now I'm going to add in a half a cup of chicken broth. And I'm going to turn my heat down a little bit. I'm going to add in three quarters of a cup of heavy cream. I'll make that one cup. This two cup container. That's about right. I'm going to add in the equivalent of three cloves of garlic. I'm using the pre-diced stuff. That's right, Dexter. We're having pork chops. Pork chops. You know, Dexter's sensitive to poultry, so I have to be careful what I say in front of him. Okay, that jar of garlic's pretty much shot. Close it up to get rid of it. Alright, now I'm going to give this a stir. Now I'm going to add the juice from one lemon in here. I'm going to get my lemon ready. And I'm going to allow this to simmer for about five minutes. So my asparagus can finish softening up and the cream will thicken up a little bit and all those flavors will blend. Okay, now my cream sauce went for about five minutes. I'm gonna add in some cheese. I'm gonna add in three quarters of a cup of shredded mozzarella cheese. I added shredded mozzarella cheese to your shopping list. And Alexa's been retorted. I did not ask her to do that. And I'm gonna add in a Here's half... What I found. Alexa, stop. I'm recording here, damn it. I'm gonna add in a half cup of shredded Parmesan cheese. We don't even shop through uh, Amazon for groceries, so I don't know why she's adding anything to a shopping list. I'm going to stir this around and let this simmer for a minute to melt that cheese. Now that my sauce is thickened up nicely, I'm going to add in a shot of white wine. It's just optional. I'm using it, doing this to thin out my sauce just a little bit. It's probably about a quarter of a cup. That'll add extra flavor too. 
how nice that's looking, guys. Now I'm going to add in a pound of spaghetti that I cooked to al dente and drained. Stir that in. I went ahead and added my chicken on top there. See how nice and golden brown and delicious that looks? And I put some fresh chopped up parsley on it for garnish. Let's go ahead and fix up a plate and see what we got. Alright guys, let me get in here and give this a try. I'll start with a piece of that asparagus. Tender. Nice and creamy from the cheese and the heavy cream. Well seasoned. Try a little bit of pasta. You can see my chicken's cooked on. Mm. Pasta's good. Try a little bit of that chicken. Well seasoned. That's really delicious and it wasn't hard at all. Alright, there you have it. Lemon asparagus chicken. Give it a try. Thanks for watching, and until next time, I'll see you.